Wandering into forest and enjoying the visuals offered by Mother Nature has been a part of my life since childhood. Uh, because I was involved into a non-governmental organization which is formally known as Nature Club Surat, where we used to go to the forest for different conservation activities and educational activities within the villages and forest. So since those days, I got an opportunity to observe nature from the closest, and that's how I have I developed deep feeling and friendliness with the nature. But after a certain period of time, I understood the values of creating art piece out of this nature photography. Most of my early years images are taken in Surat and nearby places. Then slowly and gradually I started going to different places. Those were the difficult years but then soon after I have realized and I have started moving to different parts of India. After going through so many websites and other books, I understood that I should develop some philosophy which would uh, clutch the viewers to see my work and probably that's how I started to think about a book. Last year only the word visual poetry is that came into my mind because most of my work is that people can elaborate the meaning the way they want it. I play with colors, forms, I play with lines, curves most of the time. So visual poetry, I understood that it suits my work the way I make my images. I am presenting 21 series of different photographs taken in various places in India. The first stage of the bookmaking was selection of images. I mean that is the, I guess, was the most difficult part for me. The one thing was very clear was the philosophy of making visual poetry. So I selected certain topics and certain series which belongs to fine art nature photography and there are of course some two three series which I have included which is based on natural history moments but yet they are very close to my heart and I decided to you know involve those series into the book. First we decided the paper on which we wanted to print the book. We have used the matte finish satin varnish on the papers. Uh, we decided the book size which is 12 inches by 11 and half inches now with a hard bound and canvas wrapped cover on it. After deciding everything on technical part, I, I started designing. There is no more, you know, layouting is involved. I just wanted to decide the series. I just have to put my words in a paragraph in the images. The toughest part started when we started thinking about the final printing of the job. So initially we uh, printed some 500, 600 papers to make sure that whatever we are printing is fine and the colors, correction and everything what I have done in post-production is coming well with the printers also. But the printer is quite kind, he has allowed me to go all the way to the printing area where I can sit with the printer all the time, all the 24 hours when they are doing the printing and I give my all the suggestions and we can correct all the possible colors in the images and I can make sure that all the images have come well in the book. So finally, the printing is done now. The book is in the house and the excitement level is on the peak. I hope that all my viewers who would ever buy my book would love to see the images I have presented because this is probably my first attempt to present my work in a compiled manner to all my viewers who like this kind of art form in nature photography. So if you want to buy the book, you can log into visualpoetries.com anytime and you can buy your copy from there. Thank you.